In early April, the state of Maryland bought 5 million protective masks like these at a cost of $14 million. The seller was a Washington, D.C.-based firm called Coast to Coast Strategies. The firm is normally in the business of political consulting, according to its website. One of its principals, former Republican Maryland Lieutenant Governor Michael Steele. Because of the coronavirus pandemic, the purchase of the mask did not go through the regular procurement process. Steele himself reached out to the state. We receive PPE recommendations from various sources on a daily basis, a spokesman for Governor Larry Hogan said, from politicians and legislators to baseball players and total strangers. Chairman Steele was one of those who reached to us and we referred him to our procurement officials. We asked procurement officials if the deal was competitively bid. The Department of General Services evaluates the pricing from vendors, a spokesman said, to ensure pricing is within the market rates, citing the constricted supply chain and volume of the state's need during this emergency response. In the case of coast-to-coast -coast strategies, the spokesman said, the pricing provided was well within the range. The spokesman said about two-thirds of the masks have been delivered. Just last week, a legislative committee grilled state officials about spending $12 million for masks and ventilators with a different political consulting firm. This item involving the firm that the, of which Michael Steele is a principal, this item is on the agenda tomorrow for the state's Board of Public Works. Reporting live tonight, I'm Jane Miller, WBAL-TV 11 News.